Good morning, my dear. I am Vyacheslav Katlerov in the city of Kharkiv. Today, 3 and 20 in the morning. April 19, 2017. This video is my great work produced over time. The information made public will be surprising, including all those who has a certain level of tranquility, including our physical existence, made in the form of cells. We can ask the question, why wasn't the information disclosed a year ago to the public? I suppose I entered the middle space from the wrong avenue, I assumed that the information would have been ignored. It has been done in a such a way that the video demonstration would be made available to thousands of people. Basically, a year ago, I published my first video on my network called What is the reality of our land? Where I shared our real world order. Almost 8 o'clock in the morning in the city of Kharkiv, April 25th, 2016. And now we hold our breath. Our planet is a hundred times bigger than we can possibly imagine. It's true, our planet is spherical, but its territory is incredible. There are hundreds of thousands of territories found throughout the lands and it's generally included by a ice circle. If we observe our planet from space, it looks like cells from a hive. In each of these cells there are lands. A year passed, the interest in my knowledge, in truth, our knowledge, has not been lost, but indeed has increased tenfold, even hundredfold, or probably thousandfold. In this video, I will show you the true maps of our worlds. Became intimate with the seriousness of this. Concentrate, because the following information will even stun the most talented minds in our cell. Get ready! From the onset, I would like to remind you of the Nazi expedition in the 40s. This legend has been told to use many a time. The representatives of Nazi Germany traveled to an unknown land by means of submersibles and judging from the maps. They achieved their goal. Any expert cartographer, engineer or mechanic without much effort understands the truthfulness of their documentation. The maps are dated 1943. Let's resume a bit later. For now, let's set apart and start examining the map which doesn't depict the land being flat. This is the projection of azimuth and awaiting us is a crucial moment. North and South America considered as a continent doesn't exist. It has been designated. By why? Because it serves or to fill the empty space and event files science in order to display inconsistencies. They have invented a large number of water spaces. For a matter of fact, the land is rather vast. More than we can possible imagine. And now, as both a steamed listener and spectator, let's take a look at the map of our world.
Oh, yes, yes. Rightly so, esteemed spectator. I present to you ourselves and where our home is. Probably those who have seen my videos would sigh. Stop. You are saying that those land are found in other cells. By studying my work, for the most part, I conclude that I have designed the land in the nearby cells. However, it is always said that they can be found close to each other. Broadcasting the videos before disseminating one's knowledge was a necessary way. The land do exist, and so easily by physically rigid in comparison to how we reach the nearest Iceland. The Titanic isn't sunk. It gracefully reached the nearby lands. All of these passengers are alive. The Bermuda Triangle, which boasts about 15 percent of missing ships and planes, in reality has reached the nearby lands. Olaf Janssen from the novel The Smoky God tells of a fisherman and his son who had seen these lands. The legendary protagonist of the novel The Sonic of Lands has reached the designated lands. A years after the Nazis founding a colony of these lands. Admiral Byrne, with his men, was defeated on those shores. Indefinitely, there are enough examples that confirm the existence of these lands. Everyone who owns a good means of transportation is capable of reaching these said lands with little effort. Water, air, or by going around you to our imaginative continents, Australia and Africa, confined with the Antarctic Pole. And for those people who don't know it, Antarctica is not made of ice. Antarctica is made of rock and sand. Actually, you can easily reach these lands using the inner cycle. Now we are growing nigh to the most silent discovery in the history of humanity in the last 200 years. Hyperborea exists. Hyperborea has never disappeared. The occupants are not capable of destroying a sacred place in our set. Mount Meru can always be found in the center. Yggdrasil always existed. Or in other sagas, the Jabudvipa tree. Birds fly to these lands each year to nest. This is a magic place, the place of life, the place of perpetual creation. For a simple person, the road beyond is closed, because approaching from the center would be to enter the middle of the polar ice. At this point, I conclude. Now we know, my dear spectators, why the aurora exists on the Arctic polar circle. Because many contemporary researchers tried in vain to comprehend the words unite. They didn't know and still don't know how to truly describe our planet. I will go now. Follow me on my following videos. With you, as always, Vyacheslav Kotlerov. Thank you a lot for listening. I wish you all the best until the next meeting. Thanks for your support. That's the best.